Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video and today I'll be doing a little lift test of the JJRC X1 and you can see this brand new quad here that I just recently got looks pretty sweet there with the green and such and I'll be trying to lift the Xiaomi Yi camera on here which is a very very similar shape and size to a GoPro. Um, so this is pretty much um, a test for GoPros as well and also a Mobius obviously it could lift that. Um, and now I don't have it mounted on there a very good way. I have just used rubber bands to get it on there. So it does kind of like shake and bounce. So I'm assuming that'll put a lot of shake into the video. But, you know, it's just the quickest way I could get it on there. And it's mainly just to see if it lifted. Because I'm sure you could come up with a better way like foam to or something to get it on there without jello. And I'm, I know this landing leg is going to be in the view there. But let's put it down and bind it here. Hold on, I gotta, it does this weird thing where if you get that triple beep, you have to restart the entire thing. I don't know if it's because I was listening around or what, but I'll be right back. Okay, there we go, I got it started up. You have to go kind of quick from when you plug it in, or at least not mess around with it. Um, so here we go. Um, so there we go, it can definitely lift it. I'm hovering at about 50% throttle, so it does need a little bit more, um, but it doesn't really seem to affect it hover-wise too much. You see, it looks pretty cool there. As you see, it looks pretty cool, and it's um, holding it pretty well. It's relatively in the middle, so need a little bit of trim, but just let's try some uh, punch out with it and see what we get. Okay, there we go. Not too bad. A little bit slower, but obviously that's to be expected. So let me. Bring it back here. Trim shift in a little bit. Um, so a little bit less punch out, but not too bad. So let's fly around in low rates here. And I will be including the footage from the camera after this. Right after I say this, and then there will be the credits. So This is flying around in low rates. It seems to be handling it just fine. Kick up the medium rates. Let's go fast with it. Here we go. Seems to be doing um, pretty well. And the, the camera hasn't flown off yet, so that's good. <laughs> yeah, so it doesn't actually seem to affect it much at all. It feels just like normal, so I bet you'd still probably get like 8 or 10 minutes of flight time with it on. I mean, it's obviously not an ideal camera quad, just because of the mounting options, and it's somewhat small size. Um, something like maybe this Sima um, X8G or X8C and put this on it might, would be a better option probably. But if you have this one, then you know, I just thought this test would be helpful to some people. If they're interested. So here is a medium rates funnel. Shift in a little bit. Um, but let's kick it to high rates. Do a high rates funnel. So even on high rates, it can still easily keep up um, with the weight of it. Another one here. You see that looks really cool. Really deep, nice funnels on this one. Fly around in high rates here. Get a little bit less punchy with the throttle. A little bit less response, but very nicely. Um, still flies very nicely. So I think that was good enough for the video. I mean, it was just a quick test to show if it could handle the Yi cam. So, if we're in here, I'll catch it. And now I've found an easiest way to just disarm it is just give a few clicks on the down throttle trim and it'll disarm it. And then you, um, it's still centered there so you can see. And then you can just um, do the re-arming um, procedure to get going again. But that's a lot better than doing both sticks to the outside corners. It's just giving me some down throttle trim there. Um, so there we go. That was the quick video on the... Um, JGRC X1 lift test with the Xiaomi Yi and I will be including camera footage right after this and there is some jello in it a little bit um, mainly because I think this rubber band setup I have as you can see it's very jiggly so that's probably it so you could definitely mount it a lot better I'm sure but this is just kind of the lift test and the power wise um, so there we go that was the video please subscribe if you aren't ready and I'll see you in the next one bye